Hey guys, it's Dr. George here, and today I wanted to make a brief video and talk about the recommended vaccinations that all gay men and men who have sex with men should consider. The nature of gay sex is such that there are a number of different viruses that we can be exposed to, and for this reason, there are recommendations put out not only by the CDC, but also local health departments. And this is to help prevent disease in the future. By far, you know, ones that I really recommend to all of my patients and that I regularly check for is hepatitis A and B. Both of these diseases can be quite severe and are easily prevented with vaccination. Talk with your doctor and they'll be able to give those to you. Um, across the world, there has been a number of meningococcal outbreaks, and I do recommend all people consider getting the meningococcal vaccine. Currently, I'm generally recommending the ACYW, which is the quadvalent version of that. Totally worthwhile. There's been outbreaks here in Melbourne, LA, Chicago, Europe. It's going around and meningococcal is very severe. Being a gay man, um, just the nature of being gay, the risk of developing anal cancers is 40 times the risk of the average person. If you are HIV positive, then that increases to over 100 times the risk. For this reason, it's highly recommended to get the HPV or the human papilloma virus vaccination. Here in Australia, there is going to be a multivalent version available very, very soon. Um, it is absolutely worthwhile considering it can help prevent anal cancers when you get older. If you're doing a lot of travel, I do highly recommend considering a flu shot every year and also simple things like getting your tetanus shot updated on a regular basis. These are the main ones that I recommend. So hepatitis A and B, currently meningococcal. Also consider getting the HPV vaccine and a regular flu shot and things like a regular tetanus shot as well. Be sure to talk with your doctor or gay man's health provider and they will be able to help guide you through the process of getting the vaccinations that you require.